I guess we're gonna roll with what's on the radio, right? I just hope that she was as convincing in real life as she was on the song about she's gonna get you, get you, get you. Man, my nose is itching. Woo! Gotta sneeze. Oh! What's up, everybody, on YouTube? Um, Man, I wanted to shoot a quick VT video. I hope that you guys have been enjoying my content. Uh, this past weekend, I uploaded three, three videos, I believe. Uh, some small stuff that I did with my car. Yeah, let me pull over here and park real quick because I don't want the video to be bouncy. But, um, and I want this to be a quick video too. How I look, I look okay. Got that beard growing. Um, so anyway, I posted two or three, I posted a couple videos this week. Um, I've been doing some stuff for the car, some small stuff, and man, I'm gonna be honest with you. Um, I was really gearing myself up to do something really big I consider it really big but it's probably not that big um, let me straighten that lens up it's not doing it thank you GoPro uh, I thought it was something big I applied for a sponsorship with the company that I have been I've been following for a very long time uh, when I bought my Camaro before let put it this way before I bought my Camaro I was looking at buying a BMW a brand new BMW and um, long story short I didn't like what I saw at the BMW dealership and I don't know why they changed the body styles but to me they made the cars look a little soft instead of how the BMWs did look and on top of that the BMW that I drove that I test drove had turbo lag and I'm like, who wants to drive a brand new car with a turbo and it has lag and it's a brand new car. So long story short, I've been, I've been watching this company and I've been looking at the exhaust systems that they build for high end cars, BMW, Mercedes. Um, and they also have a line for American muscle cars, Chevrolet Camaro the Dodge Challengers, the Dodge Chargers, the Dodge Durangos, uh, Ford Mustang. So they have, they create a lot of nice, in my opinion, nice high-end exhaust systems for our cars. But on top of that, they are high-end expensive. Okay. So I applied for a sponsorship. My very first time applying for a sponsorship two and a half weeks ago and I want to say a week later they awarded me with a partial sponsorship I couldn't get the 100% pot sponsorship which was a tier one I couldn't get the 50% sponsorship which was a tier two but they gave me a tier three and a tier three sponsorship if you know what it is cool if you don't know what it is I would recommend you go and do some research so um, I was really pushing to see if I can get the tier one, but unfortunately I was told that they already had uh, a Camaro like mine. They had a ZL1, they didn't have a 1LE, they had the 6.4 liter, they didn't have the 6.2 liter. Anyway, I was honored that they would give me that sponsorship so I could go ahead and promote and push their brand because it's, I, I really like their brand and I would push it I would promote it and I would advertise the heck out of that brand because I like the exhaust and uh, man needless to say I am not going to be able to go with that sponsorship I'm going to have to turn that sponsorship down because it requires me to spend a certain amount of money and Mrs. Lee does not want me spending any large amounts of money right now because we are so close at 
getting the house. Please believe when I tell you I have fought with this and I've just come down to the realization that when you're married, you, you basically just, 95% of the time, you just gotta say, okay, honey, you know what? I'm gonna do it because you asked me to do it. Um, so I'm not gonna be able to go after that sponsorship. And I've attempted to call them and let them know that, hey, I appreciate the opportunity, but I'm gonna have to turn it down. Uh, but that's what I'm gonna have to do for right now. I'm gonna have to turn down that sponsorship opportunity and hope that maybe I could pick it up after we move. If not, I still wanna get their exhaust. I'm, I'm not going to name the company. Maybe I'll, I'll put it this way. If you follow this channel, I guarantee you that their exhaust will be on my car because that's how much I want their exhaust system on my car. I've heard courses, courses sound hella good. I've heard Borla, Borla system sounds great. I've heard a few other ones and I'm just like, mm, they sound just like my car. But this company, their exhaust system, hands down, once again, this is in my opinion, hands down is the best, the best and they have a very good horsepower rating as well when you throw this exhaust on my car. My car comes with a 6.2 liter V8. And um, so anyway, long story short, doing some small things to the car. I'm going to continue to try to do small things to the car that won't get me in trouble. An error has occurred. Try again later. I didn't tell, I didn't say any, I didn't even say anything to you. Why are you talking to me? These smartwatches, man, you gotta love these smartwatches. Samsung Gear S3. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to do some smaller, more smaller things to the car. I just put on the worker build, the rock guards, uh the last video i installed the side skirts and oh my goodness everything looks good on the car so i'm getting ready to see about purchasing a few other smaller items to do for the exterior and then it's going to be a wrap on the exterior like i'm not gonna i'm not gonna do anything else maybe wrap keyword it's going to be a wrap I'm gonna let you linger on that. Just ponder on that one. But uh, I thank you guys for watching the video. I appreciate everybody's comments. I really do. I've been told that since it's the summertime, views are slow, subscriptions are slow. Trust me, I I feel it. And my channel is small. But even guys that I know that have thousands of followers or thousands of subscriptions, they're not getting a lot of views and stuff like that. The channel is going to grow. I know it's going to grow. If you believe in the channel, hey, share it. Share it, like it, tell your friends about it. And, uh, you know, let's continue to grow together, okay? So this is Mr. Lee, a.k.a. Wild and Free. I'll see you later.